What's happening, y'all? Welcome to another episode of Resident Evil. We're talking the, um, the director's cut, available on PlayStation 5. Alright. Oh, oh, what, what the... What in the heck? Okay, then. Alright, what's this? Cutscene? Alright. Oh, what? Not the dogs, bro. I'm just gonna run. Okay. Yeah, we got it. We got it. We're safe, y'all. We're safe. We got through there. Right, what's going on here? Oh, more dogs. Dog. Get it? This, this dogs? <laughs> We're being chased by dogs. Get it? Oh, no. Alright, back inside. This is a different building, I think. I think. I, I could be wrong. This, I believe this is a different building. Alright, so next up, I think I want to come down here. Right on in this door here. Look no further, because our next door is right next. And I think it's something to do with this. What exactly? I'm not sure. Unplug it, yes. And what, does this give us an item? Possibly? Alright. We want to grab this little, like, key thing here. C room key, here we go. I think we're done here now. Alright, let's let this guy come up close. I do not want to uh, shoot without, you know, shooting aimlessly. Oh! Let's go. Could have done better there, but yes. Now we need the item in the desk. Take the shells. Of course, I'll take the shells. There's something else here I need, though. Where is it? So yeah, we got some shotgun shells. I think there's another item we want here. Okay, wait, no. No, I see it. I see it. It's over here. Yeah, we want this thing. Not bad getting some shotgun cells either. Let me go ahead and, um... This is not part of the, uh, speedrunning route. Like, getting the shotgun shells, but I can combine them with my shotgun. Should be able to. Alright, not yet, I guess. Oh, that's right, that's a bazooka, not a shotgun. I don't know. I think you can get a shotgun in this game. Why else would there be shells for it? Alright, next up. Come straight on down here. Oh. Screw you, dude. I had no idea that was there in all honesty. I'm gonna need some, uh, healing stuff pretty soon. Or two. Right on in here, I think. I think. Don't blame me if something goes wrong. Alright, yeah, this is right. I recognize the area. Um, over here? There should be a key. Alright, we got our key to grab. Alright, so I think we are actually done here. We want to run from these guys real quick, and got, got him right back in that door there. Alright. Alright, and we want to use this key. Yeah, we are actually going to get rid of this key right here. 
Same key we just got. <laughs> it's useless now. Discard. Alright, let's get on out of there. Alright. And what, what we are doing here is essentially moving these things out of our way to get through here. I guess we have to move this one. A ladder! We descend it! Of course! Alright, now what's going on with this? Okay, I think I know what I want to do here. Aha! I do know what I want to do here then. Wait, wait, no. It's wrong. Come on! I really, I don't like the, uh, Force Perspective. I'm not a huge fan, I know I keep on saying that, like, every episode. But, just, just wanted to get it out there again. You know, in case you guys are hopping in, like, mid, mid playthrough. Alright, I think that's about as far as I want to push that. Uh, I didn't screw it up, did I? No, no, we're good. Are we? Are we really? I screwed it up. Okay, no, no, I can just... But then I screwed this up now, right? Okay. Why me? Oh, ho, ho, ho. oh screw you. Let me go ahead and run back here. Yes, I'm gonna climb up it. Jeez. Gee willikers. Hopefully that's gonna like reset them. Alright, wait. So just get this out of the way now. You know now that we can just push it like this, which is great for us. Come on. This isn't really required as of right now, I'm just kind of getting this out of the way. Again, I'm I'm sure I'm sorta of showing you guys what they would do like in a speedrun. I'm not doing a speedrun in case that's not obvious by the way I'm playing. Which is terribly. I could not speedrun this game if I tried y'all. I could get into speedrunning with, like, a link to the past or something. Not this thing. Possibly even Ocarina of Time. I know emulation is kind of looked down upon in the speedrunning community, but with Ocarina of Time, I do have a physical copy of that. I also have a physical copy of Link to the Past for the SNES. The thing with Ocarina of Time is that the copy I have is the um, GameCube version that comes with like the Master Quest and everything. I don't know if that's like a whole separate like. Um, Y'all you know what I'm saying. I don't know. Is that like a whole separate um whole a whole separate category in the speedrunning community? This is where things are going to get intense. 
not only are we going to have some uh, sea animals, we're also going to have, I believe, a boss fight coming up here. <laughs> All right. Uh, <laughs> there we go. All right. I need this tea? What? Oh, yeah, okay, yeah. We're discarding it now. Oh, wait, what? Uh, yeah, definitely equip that. Get me in the room now. Alright. Alright. I'm gonna go ahead and press this. There we go. Oh, it's a lever. I, I had always assumed it was like pressing that little emergency button there. You know, the big red button in the middle of the room. <laughs> and that's gonna pretty much get rid of all of the water for us. Of course I'm gonna push the button. A sound from the room next door. Uh, it's building up tension. Those of you who have played this game, I think you know where this is going. What's going on? I think we need a... Alright, I'm sorry about that interruption, y'all. But yeah, I do think we need a key here. We take the dormitory key, of course. And I think we just kind of leave. Is there... Is that ammo right there? They are all wet and useless. I was gonna say, if that's ammo, we can definitely take that. Alright, now this part here is actually gonna be pretty funny. If we walk over here... <laughs> that's, that's good. We got the shark just plopping there. Blob like a fish! I think this is where we would've come through. This is where we came in, right? Now we're just heading back up for now. I think that's where that boss fight I was thinking of would be, but following the speedrunning route, we don't do it. And from here, we would want to just sort of head out. Not sort of, we, we literally just want to head out. That's it, y'all. I think we would want to come in here. I could be wrong. I actually could be wrong on this. Um, okay, no, yeah, we're good. Well, that's, this is where we want to be, is back in here, y'all. All right, this key is useless. Let's throw it out then. <laughs> Get me in here. We do not go in that door. We want to come right on in here. A row of red books. One white book. Will you take it? Yes. As I said in the last report... Okay, yeah, we're not... We are not reading this crap, y'all. Y'all y'all can pause and read. <laughs> Alright, so now a book is missing. I think y'all know what we gotta do. Alright, the only book we have to put there is going to be this one, of course. Alright, where's this door at? Right over here for us. Alright, let's get prepared here, y'all. This is the boss fight I was talking about. Spam. Bam. Get in here. Alright, there we go. As soon as you get in there, just spam. Spam whatever you got. Oh! It's back, y'all. It's back. Alright, this is part of the game here. If you can't tell by now, this is the same game.
What a, what a monster. monster. I can't, I can't believe. believe. What the, what the hell, hell is this place, place anyway? <laughs> That's what I'm saying, man. That is what I'm saying. All right, hang on here. Hang on here, y'all. Let's run over here and grab what they got for us. Another key? What? That's crazy. That's crazy. I never would have guessed. Why are they throwing so many keys at us, boy? All right. Now that we got that little, uh, quote-unquote boss fight over, um, you know, Resident Evil is kind of known for its bosses a little bit, outside of the, uh, crazy stories, and the, um, the, I'm talking like the franchise is known for its boss, boss fights, not this one in particular, but, um, yeah, outside of its crazy stories and, um, you know, the, uh, the kind of re, redefining of 3 Gaming, along with Ocarina of Time and Metal, and Metal Gear Solid. Aside from that, you know, uh, it's kind of known for its boss fights, I'm not gonna lie. Um, yeah, I know probably around Resident Evil 4, not, not even 4, probably Veronica X is where people start praising the boss fights. Uh, yeah, we are going to go ahead and end this one here. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. Uh, drop a like, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, whatever you guys got to do to support the channel. You know, I'm not asking you to do much. I'm asking you to literally click a button. That's that's it, y'all. So if y'all could please just do that for me, it would mean a lot to me. And it would help the channel. So until the next one, y'all, peace out.